Booth. You got a chance to speak. Sure did. What, what was it about? How did you get approached? I mean, what was going on with that? Okay, so um, my management at the time, um, you know, I was in a pro- this was like had to, yeah, it was in 2019. The management that I was a part of, I was originally working on my album. I was working on Dripped in Gold around that time, but it wasn't going to be called Dripped in Gold, and it was like had a different song. So I was working. Okay. Um, and then my manager brought to my attention, like, you know, because he he had a, a lot of connections. So um, he told me about this film um, where, um, you know, people tell their experiences and like, you know, he basically told me about what the film concept was going to be about. And he knew because I was living with my manager. So like he knew like he was me and him was real close. So he knew like I have an interesting story. So he was like, yeah, you should be a part of this, you know, film. So he got me connected with the film Mm. um nice when i the first day i remember i filmed um a segment of this this documentary i literally like broke down and cried on set and um they had to stop rolling the cameras because i had to take a minute because when i was like telling what happened to me because originally the the documentary was going to be called um, Girls That Hustle, like Hustle in the Tree. It was, it was going to be called something along like that okay. line. Okay, like, um, like like some hustlers. Like, some hustler like, oh, like, shit. And I'm a like, real oh, hustler bitch, so it's like... It's like a uh, claws. That's my shit. shit really. <laughs> right. Yeah, so um, the so first time I, I, re- I literally cried on set and telling... I'm not going to tell what in particular like, yet. You, got, you guys right. got to see the film, the right. documentary, but it was a... I talked about a particular experience in my life and I couldn't like I couldn't like yeah it's like, not I, easy talking about your personal life to others because yeah no you might at all all the feedback like you said earlier at all and they was really supportive shout out to Michael Rice um and his whole staff and team um because they gave me water they like really made me like Comfort. calm down and like you know tell my story so it's interesting um but also, like, it focuses on a lot of, like, difficulties in the culture of the LGBT culture that's um, populated through New York and stuff. Um, there's, I feel like there's there's a big scene of the LGBT culture in New York City. I mean, that's, you know, New York. Yeah. Um, and a lot of the stories that you guys are going to see the, in this film, you know, uh, a lot of the culture could relate to it um i can't wait till you guys see a certain experience that i talk about because it's crazy but i've been through some crazy shit you know 